Okay, Bola Buddies, these items are trending right now, big time. And these mall brands are going for big money. Let's check it out. Hey, Bola Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, let's get started. Hey, Bola Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, I just got home and I was like, I'm gonna put the video together on this. I just keep thinking about it. I wanna do some research. So I'm just gonna pull something together, but <laughs> pulling something together ends up taking like forever because I really need to research it for you guys. But this was inspired by Butterfly Hustles. If you've not subscribed to her YouTube channel, definitely go and sub her up but she has been using this keyword in her titles. But she inspired me to look up two brands in particular. Oh my goodness, you guys, these are mall brands going for big money. This is Butterflies Hustles. Um, this is her YouTube channel and she does a lot of like uh, thrift with me and different things, but she sells clothing, but she also sells hard goods. So you're just going to learn a lot on her channel. So sub her up. I will link her down below, but I recently did a featured members video where I featured um, some of her items and two of the items that I picked to feature were this Abercrombie and Fitch sweatshirt and this express leather jacket. Abercrombie and Fitch and Express are both mall brands, but wait until you see these sold comps, you guys. I have done research on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari, and these are going to knock your socks off. I'm not even kidding you. Like, just wait until you see this. Okay, so we're going to start over here on eBay, and what I put in is Y2K Abercrombie. And you're going to see I searched high to low. Now, I have not checked to verify any of these. I didn't check feedback like I normally do for my category videos because I'm going to take you over to Poshmark and Mercari and I'm going to prove it to you guys because on Poshmark and Mercari, feedback is automatically left or, the, or they leave feedback, but you're automatically paid. So there's no non-payment or any of that craziness that goes on on eBay. So that is one thing that is fantastic about Poshmark and Mercari. If you're not selling on those platforms, I highly recommend it. I also recommend it for research when you're searching solds. Mercari is most definitely not a garage sale app as you're going to see. Um, I do have a code down in the description, um, a link and a code, and that is to join Mercari. And if you join with my referral link down below, you're going to get $10 to shop when you join. And then you're going to get another $30 to shop once you sell $100 on the platform. Okay, super easy to do. And then on Poshmark, I have a referral code down below where you get $10 to shop if you use my link and code. All right. So if you guys are interested in branching out to other platforms, um, those codes are available to get you guys those bonus perks. And then I also get a perk. So I appreciate it greatly if you use my links. Um also, I start my items on, if you're just thinking, oh, it's too overwhelming to uh, get all my items on three platforms. I use List Perfectly. I start my items on eBay, and then I cross post to Poshmark and Mercari. It's a uh, cross listing service that makes it super fast and easy. I love it. I've been using it since 2019. If you're new here, you've not heard about it. If you've been here a while, I talk about it all the time because it just saves me so much time and gets so many more eyes on my items. Um, there's a video down in the description if you guys want to check that out to see how it works. And if that interests you, you can use coupon referral code BOLO BUDDIES, all one word, to get 30% off your first month. All right, let's get started with these big money BOLOs of mall brands. Okay, so Abercrombie and Fitch. These are the eBay sales. So it looks to be that um, these are more men's items that are trending over on eBay. So um, you're going to see something totally different on, um, Poshmark and Mercari. These are cargo women's pants. Cargo pants seem to be one of the ones that just keep popping up as big money. So if you see Abercrombie and Fitch cargo pants, it looks like the cargo shorts are doing pretty good, but look at all these cargos. Okay. Another thing that is totally trending right now are these mini skirts. 
these and Y2K, this is the word that you need to put in your title if these are in that time era. Okay, this is what's trending right, right now. This is what, I don't know if the kids are buying them. I don't know what's going on. I don't really sell clothing anymore, but I just want to show you what my research has found. But putting Y2K in your title is definitely going to benefit you because people are searching that key word. All right, so here's eBay. Now wait, you ready? Let's look at Poshmark. Skirt, $280 for this skirt. This is what the vintage tag looks like, all right? So take a look at that. This is even a size zero, zero. This is a small size. Typically, small sizes are harder to find. So that tells you um, it's probably teenagers that are maybe buying these items right now. I'm not sure. Um, if anybody knows, let me know in the comments why these are trending. But um, $280. And these are from early 2000s. So Y2K in, in your title. Okay. Here's another one. Look at this one. It sold for $170. I really feel like Poshmark is a fantastic platform for these items if you find them. Um, you didn't see a whole lot of skirts over on eBay, but uh, Mercari and Poshmark, you're seeing skirts and you're seeing big money. So $170 for this one. Here's the tag again. This is a uh, plaid skirt, $160. We're going to move quick, guys, because I've got a lot for you. This one was worn by um, Bella in, um, oh, what was that show called um, or movie? Ah, I can't think of what, it, Twilight. So she wore this in the movie Twilight. So this one is a very popular one because she wore it in the movie, okay? So this is what it looks like. Sold for $150 over on um, Poshmark. You got the cargo pants, $148. Another plaid skirt, $140. This is the baby doll cardigan. So I'm seeing baby doll cardigans over and over and over again, selling for big money and not just this style. Stay tuned. 138 for that one. Another skirt, 135. 135 for another skirt. The skirts are going crazy on Poshmark. If you guys have these in your money pile, grab them and get them listed on Poshmark. The next item, um, cargo pants. This one right here is the baby doll sweater, $130. Uh, 128 here's that Bella Swan Twilight again. Another pair of cargo pants and uh, $125 for these. And they're camo. Look at this, you guys. Vintage Y2K thermal lined graphic hooded sweatshirt, $125. You guys, I'm looking at these clothes and I'm like, I used to wear these clothes. Okay, maybe not the mini skirts, but definitely some of these uh, sweatshirts and cargo pants and um, even these baby doll tops. Like back when I was really young, <laughs> I wore these. So funny. Um, this is a houndstooth mini skirt, $125. 125 on this skirt. We're going to get out of the skirts and move on to some other things. So stay tuned. Um, another skirt, 125 cargo pants, 125. This one right here is a crochet sweater, uh, $98 for this one. So I guess what I'm trying to tell you here is if you see vintage Abercrombie and Fitch, here's the tag, look it up. See if that one's trending. eBay may not be the best platform for these. Poshmark and Mercari may be better. Okay. 82 for this sweater. Like, I feel like I wore something like that back in the day. And this one, Oh my goodness. I know my friend wore these all the time um, in high school and even um, in our early college years. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh my goodness. Okay. $80 on that one. Oh, it cracks me up. Abercrombie and Fitch hooded distressed army jacket. All the clothes I should have kept. This one sold for $70. Here is just a um, spell out shirt. Abercrombie sweatshirt. Spell out is a good thing to put in the title. Here's your vintage tag, $64 on that one. All right, here we go with another baby doll top, $55 for this. How many of you guys wore these and remember these? All right, so now I am in Poshmark. And what I did is I put Y2K Abercrombie in the title. I would encourage you to go over to Poshmark and put Y2K and search solds high to low and look for other brands that are trending right now. I am just showing you two brands in this video. Okay. 
So we're just going to kind of scroll through here. I don't know what all these jeans are, but they're stock photos. So I did not um, show you guys those. If you want to go and look into that, you can. But I'm looking more for pre-owned items that I can find at garage sales and thrift stores. Now, I don't really do clothing anymore, but some of these items I may whoa, whoa, consider picking up. So lots of skirts. Look at this. This milk made crop top, $68. A cardigan sweater, $68. Um, sorry, it's really jumping around. We've got this one, which is another baby doll style, 60 bucks, which I feel like 60 bucks is really fantastic. Another baby doll tee. Here's a striped cable. Um, is that just like a, a scarf maybe? I don't know if that's a sweater or a scarf. But just absolutely crazy. Okay, so we're going to go over to Mercari and then we're going to come back and look at another brand, okay? So we are over on Mercari. $200 on Mercari for this Abercrombie & Fitch skirt. It's a mini skirt. Look at it, 200 bucks. I'm like, look at it. The next one, another, um, this is like a sweater. It says rabbit hair. I don't know why it says that. Maybe that's... Uh, the material, maybe it has rabbit hair in it. I don't know, but 180 bucks on that one. Here's another Bella Swan. This one's on Mercari, 160. So trending over there as well. Cargo um, boot cut pants, Y2K Abercrombie vintage, $140. Here's another pair of the camos, $138. You guys, Mercari and Poshmark, if you're fighting and not wanting to go on these platforms because you don't want to cross post, you really, really should consider it. Um, the cross posting, it pays for itself. List Perfectly is incredible. And try it for a month. Get your 30% off your first month. Try it. And if you don't love it, then quit. But I'm going to bet that you're going to love it. And you're going to see that a couple sales are going to pay for it. So totally, totally uh, check out that List Perfectly video down below. And 30% off code BOLO Buddies, all one word, um, to get that. All right. And pleated wool skirt, 120. So again, uh, now this one popped up under the Abercrombie. I'm guessing they probably put Abercrombie, yeah, Abercrombie and Fitch down in the, um, it says the most perfect Abercrombie and Fitch dupe. So uh, you're not, that's keyword spamming. But in this case, it, you know, I, I don't know how strict Mercari is. I know that you cannot do that on eBay. You will get in trouble. Uh, Poshmark Mercari may be more lenient about it. They might not care. I have no idea. Just be careful with it. But it did make me pull up this Hollister one. It says Y2K Hollister, Bella Swan, Baby Doll Henley, 120 bucks for that. So they're going on the Bella Swan again. Hollister might be another Y2K brand that you want to kind of look up. I'm not sure. I didn't do any research on that. Abercrombie and Fitch Stripe Baby Doll Sweater, $110. Here's another baby doll top, $102. This is another baby doll top, but this is more of a cami style, $85. Uh, baby doll empire waist. Now I know I wore these, $75 for this one. You guys, can you believe this? It's incredible, right? All right, so now I am in Mercari. These are all um, Y2K Abercrombie. So I'm just gonna kind of scroll here again. Go to Mercari, search Y2K. I am specifically under Abercrombie right now, but you can go and search um, just Y2K in general on all these platforms and figure out what's selling. But remember on eBay, you don't know for sure if they paid on Mercari and Poshmark, you're gonna know that they paid, okay? All right, so let's go over to the Y2K Express. And these are Y2K uh, ankle express jeans. They're Stella. They've got the, the zippers. Oh my goodness. How crazy is that? These sold for $85. Here's your express jeans tag right there. The next item is this Y2K express floral fitted dress from the nineties. It says never worn $80 on that one. Express is a little more, um, hidden miss. It's not as like, I would say for Abercrombie, you've got the cargo pants, the baby dolls, some of the sweaters, some of the sweatshirts, but most importantly, those little mini skirts. Here's a um, Express uh, jacket, $79 on that. Uh, this is a long maxi suede leather jacket by Express that sold for $78. This one is just pretty cool, but it's an Express coat. Now you can see they don't have Express um, Y2K in the title, 
but it's down here in the description. So with Mercari and Poshmark, it will pick up words that are in the description, okay? I think eBay, you have to click that you want it to pick up words in the description. I'm not sure. Here's another pair of like parachute type pants. These sold for $72. These are also express. This is a track suit. It's velour. Y2K velour track suit. $60 on that one. And this express crochet uh, sweater. Y2K. $59. Vintage 80s, 90s. Um, this is another like uh, jumper dress. It's got the pockets. It's an older style. 50 bucks on that one. And the tube top. Oh my gosh, you guys, I used to rock the tube tops. Oh my goodness. I actually, at one point in time, uh, story time, I had a, they were, oh, what do you call them? The ones that go around your neck that, that are like a full circle sweater. They were like scrunchy and big and they were sweater material. And I wore those as tube tops. Oh my gosh. I remember, I think I got them at Gabriel Brothers and I bought like every color and they were only like three or four bucks because they were, I don't remember how much they were, but I'm guessing they were really cheap, especially back then. But they were cheaper because they were considered a scarf and I wore them as tube tops. They were awesome. They were so comfortable and they looked fantastic. But anyway, um, back in my tube top days, so this one sold for 30 bucks. How funny is this? What are you guys thinking? Let me know. Um, Express baby doll skirt. So, you know, this one, $35, still pretty good, right? If you're at the thrift store. So we are under Express Y2K um, on Poshmark. And here are some of the other ones that popped up. I did not pull up every single one. Sometimes when you search Express, Things come up that aren't actually Express brand. So it was kind of confusing. This one was a little bit harder to research. It looks like Abercrombie & Fitch is definitely the one that you want to be um, boloing for. Look at these, these sequin leggings, 60 bucks on those. Here's just a vintage Express sweater, $58. So look up anything Express or um, Abercrombie & Fitch right now. So here we are on eBay. I have Y2K Express in and we've got this jacket. It looks like the Express vintage jackets are doing pretty good. You've got these boho patchwork Express jeans, some sweaters. Here is um, Butterfly Hustle's jacket. Look at this, this rabbit fur sweater. That looks like it's way shrunk. Um, looks like somebody threw it in the washing machine. Look at this. Oh my goodness. It's a leather mini skirt, this crop top. Okay. So I think I had, let me find where I was here. I know I've pulled a few up over here on, is this one express? Yeah. Okay. So here's another milkmaid um, top. They call it milkmaid, I guess. This one sold for 150 this express white mini skirt, $245. Seriously? I think um, that was where I started. Okay, let's go here. We've got these lace up shorts, express $57 plus shipping. And again, I'm under Mercari and I am searching express high to low. Lots of items that are not express brand because express can be kind of one of those words that can be used for other things. Um, so what I did notice is this Juicy Couture right here. So I went into Macari and I decided to search Y2K Juicy Couture. And what I found is um, a lot of purses and track suits. So for Juicy Couture, Y2K vintage purses and track suits. That's what I'm seeing the most of for that brand. Um, I don't know. Would you guys call Juicy Couture a mall brand or is that a little more high end than a mall end, a mall end, a mall brand? That would be more of a like a, a little bit maybe sold in some of the higher end stores. I don't know. OK, so there you go. Juicy Couture. All right. That's Mercari. And those are not garage sale prices, you guys. You need to get on Mercari and Poshmark. I'm telling you, they're awesome. All right. Here are. <laughs> Wow, wow, wow. Look at this. $1,100. Look at these high solds. Your items on Poshmark. I mean, Poshmark, you're just, it's a different market. It's different people buying your I uh, items. I mean, some of these people are not on eBay. I also say that people on Poshmark and Mercari are a lot of times hobby sellers. They are selling things 
just to be able to shop on Mercari. So that could go for like teenagers or younger kids um, that their parents are helping them sell stuff. And then they use the platform to buy the items they want. They're not shopping on eBay. They're on Poshmark and Mercari, you guys. So don't miss out on the opportunity to get sales on these platforms. Okay, Y2K Juicy Couture over on eBay. Again, I can't verify any of these unless I check the feedback and I'm not going to go in and do that right now. Here's a good example. This one is the same exact listing. That means it sold on September 2nd and the buyer did not pay and it was relisted and a best offer was taken. So if I showed you this listing and I did not verify it, like, I don't know if it's a good sale or not. That's what's great about looking for comps on Poshmark and Mercari. So keep that in mind, even if you don't sell on those platforms. All right. So these are all eBay. And again, your top trending are purses. When I put in Y2K, Juicy Couture, it's purses. Here's a little, um, I guess it looks like Britney Spears wore it. So a lot of times if you can find a picture where a movie star wore the item and then, you know, that's something that people are going to look for. Here's another uh, velour outfit, uh, track suit, another velour track suit. So purses, track suits. Okay. All right, you guys, what on earth is happening? What? I feel like we can go to the thrift store and find these items. Garage sales. Ah. I don't know if we're going to find them at garage sales as much, but I feel like these are things that are going to be in thrift stores. So definitely be on the lookout. Let me know. Are you selling these items? How are they doing for you? I did not search low to high. I am sure like anything else, there are going to be Y2K items that are going to be bread and butter also. But here are some of the ones that are going for big money. Uh, let me know in the comments if you knew about this, if you knew to use Y2K in your title. Um, and share this video out with somebody who you think may learn from it. Thanks so much for being here. If you're new here, let me know how you found the channel and be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and leave me an emoji of a hat in the comments. Thanks for watching.